Is your proximity sensor broken on your mom port laser? Well, this is a complete DIY guide on how to fix it. So that is the Amazon link that I bought. And then, for instance, on my X gantry, my proximity sensor has broken. So the first step is to unscrew the sensor from the X gantry. And then you got to unravel the clear plastic, I guess, wire protector or wire organizer. I'm on the right hand side of the machine now and the next step is to remove two screws that hold this drag chain assembly in place. Now this plastic track that holds all the wires in place is kind of a pain in the butt to remove. Um, I actually just kept mine off because um, I was afraid to break any wires. Now you're going to want to follow the proximity sensor wire down. Ironically the air compressor and these proximity sensor wires are the same color um, so just be careful. And then you find the corresponding I guess, hub where the wire is connected into. Once you do that, you remove this green thing from this big board. And on the side where the wire gets connected, there's a set screw. So you just got to use a small Phillips head screwdriver to loosen that set screw and pull out the old proximity wire. Now, I didn't film this, but you're going to want to feed the new proximity wire through the drag chain and all that fun stuff first and bring it down to this board. And then once you do that, you can go ahead and plug in the new proximity sensor wire and then simply just connect the new proximity sensor to the gantry again. And to test it out to make sure that you have it all set up correctly, you can just use a Phillips screwdriver over the red cap and then the light bulb should turn red. Um, unfortunately, these proximity sensors break all the time. I'm not sure why or not sure how, but unfortunately, it's the joys of owning a, a CO2 laser that has this type of sensor style. But got her all homed, good to go, and on to the next project. If you have any questions, definitely leave them in the comment section below, and I'll definitely be sure to help you answer them and whatnot. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful night.